So, you know, we've lived through a pandemic. <laughs> so, and, and I think there has been this surge in people listening to music of all different kinds uh, because, you know, we always hear music kind of heals the soul. And, and I think that, uh, talking with other people, I'm surprised by how many people have said that they have started to listen to more chamber music, choral societies, just as different art forms, musical art forms. So how does cantate bring community together, you know, when we've been through these kinds of experiences? Um, and while you're telling us about that, share more about what the uh, organization is doing. Oh, fantastic. Boy, you've given me several ways that I could answer that question. Yeah. But let me dive first into uh, this experience of having come through this time of not being able to, to share our music, because mm -hmm. I really, truly believe that music serves such a crucial function in people's lives, right? We not only can serve the function of giving people a moment to have a little release from what the world brings on, but we also can provide an opportunity to help process what it is that help, help people figure out how it is that they're going to respond to the world. And it was so hard for us during that period when we couldn't provide, couldn't perform live and couldn't help people to uh, respond in immediate time to what was happening. So we're really glad to be performing again to be giving people that opportunity to uh, just experience uh, music, live music, mm -hmm. uh, that's so important. Um, we, uh, Cantate is an organization for the many years since it was founded in 1984 has been a chamber chorus that's really been known for doing both traditional repertoire, but also engaging in commissions, presenting new works, uh, continuing to keep that, that creation of music alive. 